Good morning everyone and welcome back to the daily vlog. We are just about to leave to go and have some breakfast and then we have our race. So, how are you feeling? Feeling good. Feeling good. I've had a good night's sleep. Michelle is a little bit, um, woke up a few times, yeah? Yeah, Would you say? race nerves. Yeah, race nerves. We all get them. And we're looking forward to it. We spoke to a few people that are actually doing the event. Everyone seems pumped up for it. So it's going to be a good day. Can't wait. We kick off at 11 o'clock or 11.20, 11.10. Same. Yeah, same. <laughs> 11 same. <laughs> uh, we've got a couple of hours before that. So we need to register. I couldn't register yesterday because it was like an hour away in a cab. So we are ready. We are packed. We've got our stuff. We are going to do this. Woo! <laughs> Do you want a drink? Yeah. Yeah, go on. So team, that is the race done. We had a good time, didn't we? We had a great time. 110, 11 seconds faster than the last one. That is our PB. So 110, 20, we had, it was great. Actually, we had to go through some dark moments in that race. <laughs> Absolutely. Very dark moments. But we got to the other end of it. Did. Like sometimes you have to go through them really bad times in a race and get out the other end and show that you can actually, if you get through that, that you can still do really well. So super proud of Michelle. Yeah, I did have a, uh, a mental breakdown during the race, but yeah, managed to pull through it because of Paul's um, positive uh, reassurance. <laughs> that, uh, <laughs> I could actually do it and we ended up with the PB so I'm glad that I actually stuck with it. You yeah, I can't I can't be any more proud of Michelle. She's like there's sometimes when you think it's going bad, but I kept looking at the times when we were running and they were still bang on what we wanted to do. And so there wasn't much of an issue. It was just your head. Mental, yeah, mentally. But then the second today. half of the race is more your wheelhouse. It is, yeah. It's like the farmer's carries, like the wall balls. The row. The row are your wheelhouse. So once you got on them, it seemed to, <laughs> your spirit seemed to lift. It did, because I was only thinking, I'm putting on four more ones left. <laughs> only three left. <laughs> It was good. It kind of crept up on me at the very end that we only had like a couple left. The beginning part though, you're like, oh, there's so many things to do, but we did well. I'm proud of you. But it just goes to show that, you know, lesson learned today that if you stick with it, then I can take that forward to next time thinking it's oh, not as 100%. bad as last time. So you can do it. 100%. I think the last two races 
like Manchester the run was long yeah so we kind of got over that we got over that this one the sled the was mental, really sticky yeah. and then it kind of like everything's falling apart but you know just after that everything else is going to be fine you can't you can't lose you like you can't think the race is over just after one event or one workout Section. you have yeah. to just keep working and you did well and we we pb by 11 seconds yeah. <laughs> every second counts every second counts <laughs> afternoon team and after a fantastic race and a couple of beers we are now on our way to get something to eat just waiting for Barcelona's class of Uber, I think that's it. Is this us? Cobbify. Yeah, Suzuki 4982. Is this the dude? Yeah. This is the guy. Baby. I love every one of you. <laughs> love you. Love, love you. everyone. They're nice.